rising, grand rising. Oh man, I gotta get in the habit of changing these batteries at night. Trigger. <laughs> anyway, she man, not man. I'm back with another vlog, family. What it do, ma? What it do? Hope this video finds you in good health. I really do. But hey, like I said, it's zero dark thirty. I'm getting to it. I am. It's like three thirty in the morning or so. No, I'm sorry, four thirty where I am. Three thirty where I'm going. So I will get there earlier than I planned because I didn't account for the time earlier over there I did day before yesterday but yesterday when I went to bed and set my alarm I didn't really think about it but hey works out for the better I ain't even gonna lie works out for the better it's, it's about to fuel up this um this here trailer my truck is still good it's a trailer number I mean forget attention thinking this is gonna be you know what I mean diesel or whatever I bet you somebody has put that in their fuel or put that one in their death hey that was a quick fill up um I'm gonna run inside give me something to drink I'll pull this back out a little bit later thanks for rocking man hit that like button it's still early in the morning I should be getting to my drop off by eight or so or so <laughs> don't know exactly i will be coming in through rush hour early morning rush hour in chicago so this ain't gonna be fun here in a little bit but hopefully it's some it's nice and light outside so i can show y'all a little bit of this chicago traffic that i grew up with yeah i'm gonna have a little eventful day not too many loads and shit going on. I pushed that off so I can get some personal things done while I'm up there. But uh, stay tuned for all that. I'll be back. Peace.
made it to my drop off. Finally made it. Drop that bad boy off. Now I need to find myself another trailer. And this looks like it could be a good candidate. And it's on full. Let's check these tires. Oh yeah, we got some good meat on these. Yeah, I don't see no bulges, no cuts. Yes, sir. Let's get on up under here. Look at these brake pads, though. Damn, this one motherfucker. You can't really see the brake pads good. I need my flashlight because I can't see. Man, I don't like that. Tires look good, though. Back here too. See the type of brakes they this one dealing with. Oh yeah, I can see meat on these ones. Okay, this look like this is gonna be the better option. Same new newer tires. New tires on here, brake pads look good. Let's check see. Make sure it's empty. Should be. trailer wash out maybe depending on what I'm picking up we shall see take the lock off my other one shit let me go do that before they pull this bad boy in i forgot i forgot all right i'll check back in a little bit stay tuned they still young i'll holler peace It's our main yard in Joliet. Oh, I was reading on our paperwork that they have did I lock the other door? That they have showers and laundry facilities here. So I'm definitely gonna check that out, see how much that costs. I so need to do some laundry and I need to hit the Walmart so it can be some laundry detergent. And I need to buy some socks for new drawers. And I'm going to holler at my driver manager to see if maybe I can jump in that young Freightliner right there. That would be beautiful. I mean, I'll keep the International if I have to, but I really don't like it. I ain't even going to lie. I gave it a, what, how long have I been here? Two weeks or so? I think I'm on my third week now. Yeah, I'm not feeling it. They got a lot of trucks here. I even take the orange with all that somebody's. They got their best in there. So yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna holler at it and see what it see what it do do. Stay tuned, man. I'll pull this out when I get when I get a chance. Let's see what they got popping up in here though. First time here, like I said. I'll be back. 
If y'all interested in coming on over here, man, I put some links. There's some phone numbers in the in the description to all my recent videos. So yeah, check that out. Get your questions asked. Come on over. It's a good company. so much better you gotta have the shower wash your clothes wash your clothes for the free you feel me yes sir i was happy about that i was looking to see where to put the money or the card or whatever nothing nada so yeah i'm getting some clothes washed i went to walmart some detergent soap bought some new pants draw socks soap for myself yeah on to a good week on to the start of another week um i'm only about 40 minutes or less away from my next pickup i'll be doing a pickup and delivery in the same day so we get to the money man get to the money best i can i think i got seven hours coming back to me tomorrow so not a full day but enough to earn some cheese um somebody asked me if i take my old lady on a truck answer is no reason being is because i just started and more importantly to me just starting and not filling out the paperwork to get her on which ain't nothing i could do that right away um more importantly to that is that we alone like it's just us so i ain't got nobody to watch the baby and take her out like that she can't really come with me because we got the two-year-old three-year-old she's three now we got the three-year-old at the crib so until my sister come back around or we get somebody that we trust I can't really take her out. Um, right behind that is an important reason why I haven't done it is because I haven't even really been home. Since I started, I've been on the road for the last two weeks, going on three weeks this week. Um, I haven't had any home time yet. So the one time I did go to Memphis, that was just a turn and burn. Uh, so yeah, that's why. No real reason other than just time resources mostly resources uh there was another question i want to address what was it oh why why not stay company why did you want to go lease answer the long answer is i implore you to read rich dad poor dad that really set me on the path of um, of ownership so basically he has a quadrant maybe if i can find it i'll put it in the uh, in this video but he has a, a quadrant top left is employee below that is business owner top right is entrepreneur bottom right is an investor so you want to work from the top left down up to uh, entrepreneur down An investor is basically where you want to be An investor is when you letting your money earn money by investing it just what it says you invest money and you get returns on that money <clears throat> and entrepreneur is somebody that has a business and has people working for that business he's not trading he or she is not trading his time for money he's trading other people's time for money before that is business owner i'm a business owner now um there are some benefits to being a business owner such as taxes tax a little bit lower because you can have a lot more write-offs as a business owner rather than being an employee on top of um business owner is employee basically that's where you are <laughs> that's where most people are honestly in the world most people are employees man they go to work every day punch the clock earn a little bit of money for themselves but the line share goes to the the person or business that they work for so working my way through the quadrant and one day i will be an investor but next up is being an entrepreneur i'm gonna get this popping and start hiring people to do exactly what i'm doing but i'm brand new i'm learning a lot and i'm glad i didn't just jump into that because i need to learn more about the business before i try and run the business so um i i don't mind i don't mind jumping out there i'm just that type of person man i take risks big risks big rewards no risk your ass stay an employee <laughs> and i'm just i'm just not him you feel me um that's just the type of person i am i wouldn't have never tried even fighting 
I wouldn't have never took it from karate, man. A lot of people tell me, oh, you good at karate, but you ain't that good. What you mean? So, anyway, I became pro. <laughs> so, that's just the type of person I am, man. No pump faking. No bullshitting. M.O.B., goddammit. If you don't know what that is, all right, listen to Tupac. You'll figure it out real fast. Uh, I think that's it for now, though. Um, I'll read some more comments and address them as I can. I'm just chilling right now, pacing, enjoying some of this fresh air, washing clothes. But yeah, thanks for tuning in, man. Thanks for rocking with me all this time. It's the realest vlog on YouTube, goddammit. I holla. for today today's vlog is a wrap i looked it up and i see a trailer wash out about seven seven miles away it was either seven miles and now nah, what makes more sense it was two miles away seven minutes away two miles or seven minutes away and they open at six o'clock so i'm gonna get up early be there even before they get there Cause my pickup is at at 7 a.m. Did I say 7? If my pickup is at 7, they open at 6. I didn't get it done today because by the time I made it over here, I only had like 38 minutes left on my clock. And I didn't want to um, get in violation trying to get that done today. So I decided to wait till the morning. So that's what I'm going to do. Thanks for tuning in. No, I know it's dark. I, don't know, I doubt if y'all can even see me right now. GoPro sucking night, but yeah, deal with what you got. I ain't gonna complain. I just do better when I can. Thanks for rocking, man. Come back tomorrow and get into another load, baby. One down, one to go. I holla.